डॉक्टर बाबा साहेब आंबेडकर ओपन यूनिवर्सिटी डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक इन द ह्यूमन रिसोर्स मैनेजमेंट सेशन एट चैतन्य स्टूडियो डॉक्टर बाबा साहेब आंबेडकर ओपन यूनिवर्सिटी सो वी आर डीलिंग विथ बी बी ए थ्री जीरो टू रेग्युलर कोर्स ह्यूमन रिसोर्स मैनेजमेंट वेर इन टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस ब्लॉक थ्री यूनिट थ्री हाउ टू मोटिवेट ह्यूमन रिसोर्स सो लेट्स बिगिन टूडेज जर्नी एज इन द प्रीवियस सेशन वी हैव डिस्कस्ड हाउ employees well being would be available in organization what were the benefits terms of mandatory as well as non mandatory now today we'll see how employees or workers would be motivated from organization's perspective this side dr jignesh trivedi associate professor narayana business school so let's start the journey of today's session let's consider the learning objectives of this session what is motivation followed by characteristics of motivation how motivation would be important for the organization as well as for the workers those who are working different types of motivation followed by various theories of motivation and in the last we try to know that how we can develop sound motivation system for our organization so as the word motivation like you might have heard number of times at please do study well or perform this task well to kya bachche aisa bolte hai maza nahi aa raha hai mood nahi hai main motivate nahi hu iska matlab hai like a kind of driving force which is not there so as you can symbolize from this diagram like motivation associates with so many factors like this one of the core factor could be success why there is a whole generation of motivational speakers available and in pandemic situation it was on top so it's about how you develop your attitude how you can set your goals how you can successfully implement your ideas how you can get support from others and how you can support others ultimate to become a successful person that's why motivation is essential in various facets of our life sirf padhai ke liye ya sirf job ke liye या सिर्फ रिलेशनशिप के लिए ऐसा नहीं है मोटिवेशन वर्क्स इन ईच एंड एवरी फेसेट ऑफ अवर लाइफ इंक्लूडिंग अभी अगर हम बात करते हैं पढ़ाई की या जो काम हमें मिला है वो काम की तो वहां पे भी देर इज अ डिफरेंस बिटवीन अ पर्सन हु इज हाईली मोटिवेटेड एंड द अदर वन हु इज नॉट मोटिवेटेड सो लेट्स चेक अप ऑन सम वंडरफुल डेफिनेशन गिवन बाय स्कॉलर्स Michael Jusius said it's an act to stimulate someone to get a desired course of action matlab aap kisi ko prerit karta hai ki aapko ye kaam karna hai that is what you are motivating like your parents are providing motivation to you so that you can study well motivation is a work of a manager to perform in such a way so that he or she can inspire encourage people to take required action jaise being a teacher ye video bhi ek tarike ka motivation hai baba saheb ambedkar open university chahti hai ki jo bachcho ne admissions liye hai gujarat ke ya india ke kisi bhi kone mein to bhale aap physical classroom mein na aa paaye face to face teachers ke sath shayad aapka dealing na ho paaye but with the help of such kind of simulation like ye online interaction se particular subject mein aapka interest develop ho 
और पर्टिकुलर सब्जेक्ट के आपके प्रॉब्लम सॉल्व हो सो दीज वीडियोज आर नथिंग बट टू प्रोवाइड यू अ मोटिवेशन सो दैट यू कैन स्टडी वेल यू कैन लर्न दिस सब्जेक्ट बेटर ऑर्गेनाइजेशन एक मैनेजर का भी यही काम है मैनेजर इज डूइंग द सेम मैनेजर इज ट्राइंग टू पुश दर एम्प्लॉज द वर्कर्स सो दैट दे कैन वर्क बेटर एक काम जो माँ बाप करते हैं जो शिक्षक करते हैं वो ही काम एक मैनेजर करता है मोटिवेशन इज अ प्रोसेस टू स्टिम्यूलेट पीपल्स एक्शन टू एकम्प्लिश डिजायर्ड गोल्स यू हैव टू पुश सम वन फ्रॉम होम यू हैव टू गेट सम थिंग्स डन being a superior if you would like to done some task with the help of others you have to motivate them you have to just push them in a positive manner that's what motivation is all about now if we check the characteristics of motivation generally it's an internal feel subah 5 baje uth ke daudna hai you have to be very much self motivated otherwise someone just try to help you out another day you will be not in a scene to wake up so it's an internal one it's related to your needs you are already fit and fine and someone else has already told you the same then you won't go for any sort of jogging or walking you won't go motivation is associated with goal related behavior aapko batana padega aap ye kaam karoge isse kya hoga मोटिवेशन कैन बी बोथ पॉजिटिव नेगेटिव एग्जाम में चोरी करने वाले जो छात्र होते हैं सो सम ऑफ द पीपल हैव गिवन देम काइंड ऑफ एडवाइस डोंट रीड मच मेक सम चीट्स एंड यू विल पास आउट दैट्स अ नेगेटिव मोटिवेशन नॉट टू स्टडी बट टू गो विथ नेगेटिव और नॉट प्रॉपर वे ये भी एक तरीके का मोटिवेशन ही है इट्स अ कॉम्प्लेक्स प्रोसेस बहुत ईजी नहीं है मोटिवेशन टू टाइम you have to convince people you have to push them up by touching the points where actually they can feel themselves motivated aap bol doge ki ha chalo kal se ye kar dena aur ho jayega it's not that much easy task now what are the benefits you all are aware simply will check one once again it's a directing element motivation helps to direct people to guide people managers can guide people by providing proper amount of motivation if motivation is there your employees would be highly satisfied because kahin na kahin se motivation mil raha hai wo organization mein se aa raha hai kahan se aa raha hai that's not that much big question motivation will leads to satisfaction and if motivation is there people can perform up to greater extent sometimes unbelievable level so motivation leads to performance class mein the one who is not able to study well but if it has been pushed up by teachers properly that same student can get rank in the university or in the state board that's possible why because you have motivated him if you succeed to motivate someone performance would be end product and performance will come for sure motivation will helps to create willingness aapko maine jo example diya tha subah 5 baje uth ke daudne ka ya gym jane ka hai na but if the motivation is in the right manner then what will happen people will develop that willingness nahi kuch bhi ho jayega today morning if i got up and i run tomorrow if i'll be motivated properly if there is a rain or if there is too much cold but my willingness would be so strong that i'll go and i'll complete my running if i have been properly motivated internally or externally so these are the advantages of motivation it actually helps both the parties from organization perspective as well as from the individual perspective good industrial relations would be a by product if motivated people are there they don't waste their energies into fighting with one another without necessary frictions would be very less superior will tell something 
the next party the immediate receivers will accept and follow and walk accordingly no more frictions if people are equally motivated changes could be implemented without much problems resistance aayega but itna nahi aayega agar aapne logo ko motivation deke rakha hai people know that what is good for them and how company is making changes to kya hoga वो बंदे अपने आप जो चीजों में बदलाव आया है उसे एक्सेप्ट कर लेंगे मोटिवेशन हेल्प्स यू टू यूटिलाइज थिंग्स ऑन अ मैक्सिमम पॉसिबल मैनर ये सीधी सी चीज है कि आपको जो प्रोडक्ट दिया है या जो मशीन आपको दिया है इफ यू आर हाईली मोटिवेटेड यू विल ट्राई टू वर्क इन सच अ मैनर दैट यू कैन जनरेट मैक्सिमम पॉसिबल आउटकम फ्रॉम दैट प्रोडक्ट और फ्रॉम दैट मशीन That is only possible when you are fully motivated. सही तरीके से आप काम ले सकते हो और काम कर सकते हैं These are the advantages of motivation. Now let's check up on types of motivation. Positive motivation, as I have given you an examples, as well as negative motivation we have seen. Then there would be achievement motivation. आपको बोला है कुछ भी हो जाए इस बार क्लास में टॉप टू ही करेगा and you have decided yourself i will have to have first prize in my class this time to ye kya ho jayega achievement motivation hai aapka affiliation motivation i will make the highest number of networking in terms of having highest number of new customers this time to ye affiliation motivation hai networking aapko strong karna hai competence motivation मैं स्किल सेट में इंप्रूव करूंगा मतलब अगर हमारा क्वालिटी 95 परसेंट तक आता था दिस टाइम वी हैव डिसाइडेड विल गो अप टू 98 परसेंट विल इंप्रूव आर कॉम्पिटेंसी विल इंप्रूव आर स्कोर स्किल्स पावर मोटिवेशन अगर इतना किया आपने यू माइट हैव सीन अ काइंड ऑफ मोटिवेशनल सीरीज यूपीएससी एक्सपीरियंस या मूवी इन टर्म्स ऑफ लक्ष्य so what they have seen anyhow people would like to achieve that position ki mujhe army mein ye position pe jana hai mujhe ias ya ips banna hai this is what power motivation you want that power and the power itself motivates you attitude motivation so these are various types of motivation now that's not been decided very early before actual task has been allotted to the individuals now let's check upon some known as well as unknown theories of motivation you might have studied few of them in your previous syllabus might be in schools also let's refresh your learning as far as motivation theories are concerned and let me make you aware with the fact that these theories are not only from understanding perspective but in real time in organizations managers are using this theories in order to motivate employees those who are working under them and many managers got success to make the people motivate and get excellent work done from them let's check up on few of those wonderful theories of motivation first old is gold wala abram maslow maslow's need hierarchy theory so it's been started with physiological needs roti kapda makan food shelter and clothes the basic one people are expecting when it has been completed or achieved partially or fully then people move towards the next one that is safety security needs like job security whatever is our salary or wages the kind of house we have kind of area where we are residing we have to maintain so that is safety or security needs then one step ahead after completion of both primary needs or basic needs that is physiological and safety that next would be belongingness and love that 
kind of relationship we would like to be social people should know us we should know people we would be part of a group then one stage ahead self esteem like we would feel that we are having the self confidence we believe that we are esteemed ones we could able to achieve targets which has been decided by us and decided by others for us so both social as well as self esteem needs are part of psychological needs and towards the top the peak of the pyramid is self actualization need very small number of people in the world tends to have this accomplishment where you feel that you have achieved something in life and because of you the discipline the fraternity you are working that discipline or fraternity itself got enriched best examples could be mahatma gandhi mother teresa dr abdul kalam amitabh bachchan sachin tendulkar these are the people can say that yes they have achieved something or because of them a particular discipline got enrichment so that's called self actualization so from bottom physiological to self actualization according to maslow one by one people would try to climb the next level of need once they will get satisfied the particular level of need they'll be motivated in order to achieve the next level of need that's abraham maslow with need theory move on to the next one hertzberg comes up with the same sort of thought which has been provoked by maslow wherein he has bifurcated things into two part one hygiene factors another motivators as you can see in the bottom of the slide extremely satisfied neutral and extremely dissatisfied why this has been there according to hertzberg hygiene factors are such presence won't make much difference but absence create a huge difference it's like you have applied for a job and they said yes this would be the salary you said fine ab aapko pata hai ye kaam karne jaoge salary milega but kisi month aisa hua salary aayi nahi shock ho jayega na aapko ekdam to wo kya hai सैलरी आई आपको पता चला डिपॉजिट हुआ बहुत ज्यादा फर्क नहीं पड़ेगा बिकॉज यू नो एवरी मंथ दिस पर्टिकुलर सैलरी विल कम बट अगर किसी मंथ नहीं आया देन यू रियलाइज एंड यूल हैव अ क्वेश्चन मार्क यूल बी शॉक्ड सो हाइजीन फैक्टर्स आर सच ऑल दोज आर ऑन स्क्रीन देर एबसेंस विल फेल्ट ग्रेटली बाय पीपल एंड मोटिवेशन विल गेट डाउन लाइक एनी बट प्रेजेंस विल नॉट मोटिवेट पीपल हाइजीन फैक्टर्स है वो है जैसे हम हम अभी जो द वे वी आर ब्रीदिंग इन एंड आउट ऑक्सीजन है हमें पता है हम कदर नहीं करते बट अगर किसी ने हमारा गला दबा दिया तो इमिडिएटली वी रियलाइज कि हाँ सांस लेने में तकलीफ हो रही है दो हाइजीन फैक्टर है अंडरस्टैंड देन नेक्स्ट इज मोटिवेटर्स मोटिवेटर्स मीन्स सच फैक्टर्स विच हेल्प पीपल टू इम्प्रूव दर मोटिवेशन आप जो काम कर रहे थे अचानक से चैलेंजिंग टास्क मिला आपको एंड दे सेड कि हमें पता है यू कैन डू दिस आप जो काम कर रहे थे जो सैलरी है उसके साथ कोई एक्स्ट्रा ऑर्डिनरी इंसेंटिव एड कर दिया कि इस बार जो एक टारगेट अचीव करेगा उसको कंपनी की ओर से कार मिलेगा आप जो काम कर रहे हो उसके लिए कंपनी है सेड की फुल ऑटोनॉमी गिवेन यू आर द बॉस यू कैन डिसाइड हाउ टू अलोकेट रिसोर्सिस हाउ टू गेट वर्क फ्रॉम अदर्स ये सारी चीजें क्या है इट मोटिवेट्स पीपल इट इंक्रीज मोटिवेशन सो यू फील दैट पीपल आर वर्किंग नॉर्मली यू वांट अ किक फ्रॉम देम इन टर्म्स ऑफ ग्रेट परफॉर्मेंस यू हैव टू हैव अ काइंड ऑफ मोटिवेटर्स आपको ये सब ये सब कैसे है एक्सिलेटर पैडल जैसे सो यू हैव टू अप्लाई फ्यू ऑफ दो मोटिवेटर्स एंड पीपल विल वर्क सो दीज आर टू फैक्टर्स हाइजीन वंस एंड द मोटिवेटर्स then david magalands come with three needs theory now what magalands said every individual can have mostly 
एनी वन ऑफ दीज थ्री नीड्स एक ऐसा बंदा हो सकता है हु इज इन दीड ऑफ एफिलियशन जुड़ा हो वॉन्ट टू एफिलियट वॉन्ट टू गेट एसोसिएट फ्रेंड्स बनाने हैं रिलेशन बनाने हैं ही और शी इज ऑलवेज रेडी टू हेल्प अदर्स ही इज रेडी टू हेल्प अदर्स बाई सेक्रीफाइसिंग ही इज और हर ओन पार्ट ऑल्सो ही इज अ गुड नेटवर्किंग गाय ही वुड लाइक टू बी इन अ गुड बुक ऑफ अदर्स तो ये बंदा क्या चाहता है नीड टू हैव इन रिलेशनशिप एफिलियशन जुड़ा रहना चाहता है नो वन शुड से एनी थिंग रॉन्ग अबाउट हिम और हर ये एक ऐसा बंदे होता है दूसरा है नीड ऑफ अचीवमेंट लाइक पीपल दो आर द रियल टास्क मास्टर्स वुड लाइक टू अचीव बिकॉज दे आर द कैपेबल वन उनका काम से काम क्या करना है मैं ये अकॉम्प्लिश करूंगा आई विल अचीव दिस और मेरा नाम आएगा कि दिस वॉज द जेंटलमैन और दिस वॉज द लेडी हु हैज अकॉम्प्लिश दिस उनका क्या है प्योर फोकस अपॉन टास्क दे डोंट वॉन्ट टू बी एसोसिएट विद अदर्स दे डोंट वॉन्ट टू बी टीम मैन ऑलवेज दे जस्ट वॉन्ट टू हाईलाइट दैट हाउ मच टैलेंटेड दे आर कंपेयर टू अदर्स कितने पावरफुल है इन टर्म्स ऑफ अकॉम्प्लिशिंग टास्क ये हमारे बिना नहीं हो सकता हम ही ये करेंगे दैट्स वॉट नीड ऑफ अचीवमेंट वो आपको काम करके दिखाएंगे दैट इज नीड ऑफ अचीवमेंट एंड द थर्ड वन नीड फॉर पावर अब ये ऐसे लोग हैं, दे वॉन्ट चेयर कुर्सी जिसको बोलते हैं सत्ता दे वॉन्ट अ पोजिशन मैनेजर वाइस प्रेसिडेंट सी एफ ओ सी ओ ओ आई नीड डेजिग्नेशन आई नीड पावर बेस्ड अपॉन दैट डेजिग्नेशन रुतबा चाहिए I should have that position so that I can control others. I can manage or manipulate others based upon the power which I am having. They are looking for power. पैसा नहीं दोगे तो चलेगा काम नहीं कर पाएंगे तो चलेगा They need power. So in organization you can have three types of people. Whether one who would like to affiliate with everyone, second who would like to achieve everything. and the third who would like to have power authority over others so what magellan said you have to identify that actually what this particular person is expecting aapke paas jo kaam kar raha hai wo banda kya chahta hai isme se kaisa banda hai usi hisab se vyavhar kariye usi hisab se aap cheezon ko allocate kariye and he will not make you dissatisfied he will not make you disappoint he will perform for sure बट हमें ये पता लगाना पड़ेगा बीइंग अ मैनेजर बीइंग अ सुपीरियर एक्चुअली ये तीन में से वो चाहता क्या है मेनी टाइम्स इट हैपन इट वांट बी इन एब्सोल्यूट वन बट इट वुड बी ऑन अ फ्रैक्शनल लाइक 80-20, 80 परसेंट पावर 20 परसेंट एफिलियशन और 80 परसेंट अचीवमेंट एंड 20 परसेंट एफिलियशन दैट इज दैर बट वॉट वुड बी ऑन मेजोरिटी वी हैव टू फोकस अपॉन दैम Theory X and Y, interesting theory by Douglas Magar. So Magar has said, theory X, ऐसा बोलती है, people are not good, लोग काम चोर हैं. In short, people don't like work, people hates work, people try to run away from work, काम नहीं करता है, काम पसंद नहीं करता है, काम करना नहीं चाहता है. Theory Y ऐसा बोलती है, नहीं नहीं. People are nice, people actually want to work, people know how to accomplish the task. and they are self motivated wo acche se apna kaam karta hai and the way they have that leisure the same way they would like to perform their work so in organization also you can find people those who have a orientation towards theory x or theory y aise log bhi honge jo kaam ko bahut samajhte honge and you will have people those who are enjoying their work now you have to identify people based upon theory x or y and accordingly allocate tasks and you can figure out how to motivate people with theory x or theory y mindset alder fares erg theory that is nothing but a kind of extension of abram maslow's need theory so what he said instead of five needs which has been developed or originated by maslow he has clubbed those five into three stages that is erg existence relatedness and growth so according to alder fair 
first two like physiological and safety or security needs would be part of existence need jina hai na to ye chahiye roti kapda makan aur ek security so people are working hard on this existence part at least they can survive both physiological as well as security needs then once this has been accomplished aur dar nahi hai ki ab ye nahi jayega then people will move to next one try to relate others with oneself social needs be in connections be in contacts aur thoda bahut market mein hamara naam ho if people get satisfaction then on final part people try to move that is growth self growth self esteem a great level of self confidence you have that thought that you can control things you can achieve things and next would be self actualization a position a situation where you have decided or where you can proclaimed that yes i have achieved and i have given something to the fraternity for which i have spent most of the time of my life so maslow's five needs have been converted into three needs given by alder fads E R G E stands for existence first two followed by relatedness the social one followed by growth the later two that is self esteem and self actualization so we have to figure out on which stage an individual is staying right now and accordingly we can push them now victor vroom's expectancy theory again an interesting one given by mr vroom so what he has said people are putting up efforts in order to achieve something so generally what happen i have i thought that this month i have to become a topper in terms of achieving target why because i am in need of a car and company has decided that whosoever will sell highest number of product this month will be awarded one car from company as a reward so what i am thinking i have to work hard i have to put my more than 100% why because if i'll give my more than 100% i can overpower others i would be highest in terms of my performance my performance would be extraordinary so what will happen if my performance would be extraordinary i will achieve the goal i will achieve the target first so what happen organization will give me reward organization will give me reward means i will be the contender who can get a car and if car will be given my goal would be achieved why because as i told you in the beginning my goal was to have a car now i came to know that whosoever will be the one achieving highest number of sales can get a car from a company so i stipulated my efforts in such a manner so that i can overpower others i can outperform others i can be the topper i can be the highest sales maker and resultant company can give me a car and in company company gives me a car as a reward i would be the satisfied one right but just think if last moment company has changed the pattern has said nahi nahi is bar car nahi dete hai jo banda first aaya usko hum 1 lakh rupya cash denge baat khatam main demotivate ho jaunga kyunki maine kya socha tha maine itni mehnat kyun ki thi because i wanted to have a car now company is giving me cash price paisa to mere paas bhi hai but nahi mujhe paisa nahi chahiye mujhe to car chahiye thi कार कंपनी अगर कैंसिल कर देती है तो अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस थियरी मेरा एक्सपेक्टेंसी लेवल टूट जाएगा नेक्स्ट टाइम से कंपनी मुझसे काम करवाना चाहेगी तो मेरा एक्सपेक्टेंसी लेवल मैच नहीं होगा आई कुड नॉट परफॉर्म एज पर दी एक्सपेक्टेंसी ऑफ माय ऑर्गेनाइजेशन सो एज अ मैनेजर वाई दिस थियरी इज इंपॉर्टेंट एज अ मैनेजर यू हैव टू फिगर आउट दैट एवरी इंडिविजुअल कैन नॉट हैव सेम नीड्स है ना हम सबको सेम चीज नहीं चाहिए तो आपको पता लगाना पड़ेगा कि इंडिविजुअल्स क्या चाहते हैं यू हैव टू फिगर आउट व्हाट आर देयर एक्सपेक्टेशंस अकॉर्डिंगली कन्वर्ट देम इन रिवॉर्ड्स एंड पुट अप बिफोर दोज इंडिविजुअल्स 
then see people will walk like magician in order to achieve that that's what victor vroom is concluding now how we can have a sound motivation system so sound motivation system is something which can justify the needs and objects of both organization and employees as i told you in vroom's theory only company bol rahi hai target achieve karwa dete hai paisa de denge ऑर्गेनाइजेशन में बंदे हैं वो बोलते हैं टारगेट अचीव करवा लो काम कर लेंगे गाड़ी चाहिए कंपनी पैसा दे रही है वो गाड़ी चाहता है सेम नहीं है टारगेट अचीव नहीं होगा बिकॉज पीपल डोंट थिंक इट्स अ मोटिवेटिंग फैक्टर आप वीकेंड पे उनको बोल रहे हो कि हम आपको मूवी टिकट देंगे जो ये काम कंप्लीट करेगा अब वीकेंड पे मैच है कोई मूवी देखने जाना ही नहीं चाहता ऐसे केस में क्या होगा पीपल विल नॉट गेट मोटिवेशन दे विल नॉट वर्क अंडरस्टूड job should be designed in such a way to provide challenges and some sort of variety aapko dena padega ki bhai ha logo ko thoda sa feel ho ki kuch naya kar raha hai kuch badhiya kar raha hai variety lani padegi monotonic kills creativity managers need to make sure that they can run in such a manner they'll win the cooperation of their employees in order to improve the output given by them in organization and subordinates should have that realization obviously with the efforts of manager ki bhai wo sirf yahan kaam nahi karta hai they are also part of the same family wo stakeholders hai aisa realization aana chahiye motivation system aapka jo banega it should satisfy the different needs of different people as i told you again repeatedly sabka same requirement nahi hota hai ek restaurant mein aap jaate hai there are 200 items in menu so from morning to evening number of people are visiting and they are giving different orders all want to give the same right similarly motivation bhi sabka alag alag rehta hai to aapko alag alag offer karna padega aap bologe sabko ek jaisa hi milega half of the people enjoy another half they'll be dissatisfied now factors which determine the response to motivation the intensity of the drive main chahta hu ki i should remain fit so i would like to join a gym ab intensified hai mujhe join karna hi hai if my company wish is to offer free gym coupon i will love to work but baki log hai jinko they don't have that fitting freak wala ad to unko nahi jana gym karne to wo particular ad ya wo particular offer unko incline nahi karega second past experience like previously what has been told by the boss kaam ho jayega ye denge diya to badhiya nahi diya yaad rakhenge chhodenge nahi next time aap kaam bologe public nahi karegi amount of reward quantity and quality of reward you have said extra sabko milega what extra you have given 1 by 20 it's not considered to be extra it is considered negligible avoid kar sakta hai next time when you say extra milega people will not stay time relationship of response to reward aapne bola tha ye kaam complete hoga you will be getting reward reward january mein kaam kiya december ho gaya reward nahi aaya justice delayed is justice denied jaisa hai aapne bola hai reward milega matlab reward in time milna chahiye na agar month khatam hua target achieve ho gaya to next month you should provide them reward अब बोलोगे थ्री मंथ बाद मिलेगा सिक्स मंथ बाद मिलेगा एक साल बाद मिलेगा कोई मीनिंग नहीं है पीपल विल नॉट हैप्पी मेथड्स टू ब्रिंग आउट एम्प्लॉय मोरल क्या कर सकते हैं राइट टू एक्सप्रेस देयर फीलिंग्स एंड गिविंग रेमेडियल सजेशन यू कैन ऑफर एम्प्लॉयज शुड हैव एन अपॉर्चुनिटी टू सॉल्व देयर ओन प्रॉब्लम दैट्स अ ग्रेट मोरल बुस्टर दे बी मोटिवेटेड हमारा काम है हम सॉर्ट आउट कर लेंगे kind of short term goals to build confidence and self so performance aapko ek performance oriented purpose define karke dena padega in short time aap bolo 5 saal mein ye karenge wo karenge that's fine but what about next month what about next quarter you have to make them realize celebrate victories and examples kya hota hai chhota chhota jab galti hoti hai to you keep on scolding similarly agar bahut acha kaam kiya hai you keep on celebrating you keep on telling them you have done fabulous work 
ये सारी चीजें हेल्प करती है एम्प्लॉइज को अपना मोटिवेशन बाहर निकालने में दीज आर द फैक्टर्स विच कैन इंफ्लुएंस एम्प्लॉय मोरल लीडरशिप को वर्कर नेचर ऑफ वर्क वर्क एनवायरमेंट एंड द एम्प्लॉयज दम सेल्स दे विल ब्रिंग पॉजिटिव और नेगेटिव मोटिवेशन इन टू द सिस्टम सो डियर स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस सेशन वी हैव डिस्कस्ड various theories and concepts of motivation along with how manager can utilize these particular theories in order to motivate people in organization and as an end result these people will work greatly for the organization benefit ultimately if along with the organization those employees are getting same advantage then only this motivation effect will remain in continuous hence we have seen different ways and means how organization can make their employees or workers motivated so that's it from this particular topic soon we'll discuss the next topic that is block 3 unit number 4 till then thank you so much happy learning thank you क्या यहाँ पर